Do you know that in Ontario, we didn't used to need doctor's notes? Before Doug Ford took office, if you were sick for less than five days, you didn't need a doctor's note. Your work could not require you to get one. The former liberal government made this change and got rid of that requirement because doctors were saying that it was taking up a lot of their time. When this change was made, family doctors said that they finally had more time to actually see their patients for real concerns. And so what did Doug Ford do in his first year in office? He reversed that change, making medical notes mandatory again. Which is why we're seeing the Canadian Medical Association saying that we need to scrap sick notes for minor illnesses. And eliminating these notes could prevent 12.5 million unnecessary healthcare interactions a year in Canada. But Doug Ford doesn't want to acknowledge the problem that he created. He's saying that the reason that there are ER pressures is because people are going to the ER for things that don't require urgent care and they should be going to their family doctor, even though 12% of the Ontario population doesn't have a family doctor. Maybe people would have more access to a family doctor if we weren't wasting family doctors' times with medical notes. Because that's Doug Ford in the conservatives' playbook. Starve the beast, break the system. Once it collapses, you can replace it with privatized healthcare at the benefit of your billionaire buddies.